to me, it was like, come on. I mean, you got to do think of something better than that. So that's why I'm sitting here as you know, <laughs> at a tennis academy, and he's worth $25 billion. What do you know about how you got Nike founder Phil Knight into the business of tennis? When, when I first signed with Nike, I've been actually Nike, with Nike since May of 1978. Connors and Nastasi, and I believe 75, you know, started wearing the swoosh, the Wimbledon sneakers that I was wearing for a while. And this was just starting to happen, you know, exploding in a way that players, athletes would actually get paid to wear, you know, equipment, sneakers, clothes, et cetera, rackets. I mean, this was like a new thing. When I was getting a lot of heat from the establishment in tennis and people are like, suspend Mackinac for a year, he's bad for the game, I'd get a call. It would be Phil Knight and he'd be like, keep doing what you're doing. Really? Yeah, yeah. And he, he loved it. And he would actually do campaigns that would sort of, um, support what I did. Uh, you know, one of them was like Nike tennis shoes are better than Dunlop rackets, which I used because I was, you know, about to snap one of my wooden rackets. So he would take what appeared to be a negative, you know, a lemon and turn it into lemonade. And so he was the first guy that I went to because obviously over the year, Phil was really big into tennis and it was sort of, uh, and he played a lot and he was around the tournaments. And over time, he's certainly been far and away the number one supporter when I started the Tennis Academy. What do you remember from when Phil Knight came to you and asked, uh, what do you think of Just Do It? <laughs> um, well, we were out in Portland, and at that time, you know, I don't know how many buildings there are now, there's got to be 25, but at that time, I think there was five or six. So the fact that I had my name on one of those and um, that Phil was, his office was in my building, you know, made me feel pretty good. I was, you know, feeling full of myself. Uh, and um, then, obviously, just because you're an employee, you're involved, and they're trying to throw out things that may or may not work, and not all of them do. One of them was, you know, I've got this idea for Just Do It. Terrible idea. <laughs> That's know. what you said. Yeah, terrible idea. Why? You know, everyone says that. Well, exactly. But to me, it was like, come on. I mean, you got to do think of something better than that. So that's why I'm sitting here as, you know, <laughs> at a tennis academy and he's worth $25 billion.